Good evening. It is now October 15th, 2021. And I'm just going to share with you some God thoughts that were actually from the last part of August 11th, 2021, which I didn't share these with you. I did share a three-part series for that day, for that day. Um, but I didn't include this, um, this one, but I thought I would share it with you because I ran across it tonight and it's really good timing of um, running across this because God um, he's so amazing in what he shares with us and you know sometimes we forget the things that God shares with us or reveals with reveals to us so if you're a prayer writer and, and a journalist person the person likes journaling I encourage you to go back and look at your your journals and your writings and it just will be so encouraging for you. So um, I'm at a place right now where I am concerned about my daughter and my grandchildren. And uh, I have had a lot of regrets. And so on this particular day, I had noted in the journal that I had a vis visual visualization of um, just many memories of things I went through and wrong decisions I've made over the years that was altered where my daughter is and would would have been like I just I really do look at a lot of things choices I made that you know of course put me in the position that I'm in but also how it has affected my daughter's life too so anyway um, what God thoughts are very encouraging because it's not only encouraging to me this these will be encouraging to you too because God is referring to his children not just me when he's revealing this um, writing and what he is doing in our lives um, in this, let's say, hour or, you know, this time period. So, um, okay, so here we go. So, God Thoughts from August 11, 2021. My daughter, my daughter, why do you get dismayed? I have shared many times before the things of the past will be made right. I have overcome the world, and I will not let the evil prevail. Lighten your load, lay it at the cross. At the feet of Jesus that day, he paid for all the sins of this world. As I have said, I am at work in your life and in all my children's lives to make all things right, to renew your spirit within and to make manifest the purpose of your callings. Remain steady and steadfast. A shifting and alignments are taking place. Stabilization is occurring with the added strength I give you to stand up and to stand strong against the ways of this world and the wiles of the devil. Great help is coming soon. Anticipate the arrival again. Do not be dismayed. I have taken care of everything, so no need to worry. All will be well with thy soul. You will be happy and free from the ties and change that ch chains that try to bind you. I hold you in the palm of my hand. I have secured your heart and established for you and those who accept Jesus my son will live in the heavens with, uh, with us from life to everlasting. We need to learn, okay, from life to everlasting. Okay, anyway, so I just want to share that with you. I thought it was really good. Um, and then... Uh, I don't know about you guys, but also I've been hearing or seeing a lot of um, numbers with 1010, 10, you know, 1010. 10, um, so that was really cool too. But I hope I hope that encourages you because again, God is talking and sharing, you know, this information with anybody who's listening to this video. And um, of course, you can pray about it. But um, God is for His children, and He will not let the evil prevail. So just hang in there and um, 
keep drawing near to the Lord, and the more you draw near to Him, the more He will reveal to you and guide your steps, and you want to walk in His steps. All right, take care, and God bless, and um, this will be, by the time it's uploaded, it will be on uh, October 16th, 2021. Okay, take care. Have a great weekend. Okay.